Welcome to the immune system. Wait, 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 I'll do it. Today I will be taking you through some of the important parts that protect our body from invaders like bacteria and viruses, among others. Today our evil invader will be portrayed by Mr. Cat. Mr. Cat? Oh, what's the use? I'll just do it myself. Let's start with the barriers of the immune system. There is the skin, hair, and mucus. They stop or trap the germs before they even make it into the body. Gotcha! Next, I will explain all the cells that help the immune system run smoothly. First, there is the phagocyte. The phagocyte is the feeding cell of the immune system. It eats up all the trash and invaders. MHC is short for Major Histocompatibility Complex. You're an invader! And is the molecules on the surface of cells You're that identify invader. cells as part of the body or not. You're a regular cell. And they also help regenerate T cells, which we will get to later. There are also helper T cells, which are the immune system's chief of operations. They identify the invader and stimulate the production of other warriors to join the battle against the invader. Next, there is lymphokines, proteins that are used for communication by immune cells. They boost the immune system's response to disease germs. Killer T cells are next. They wipe out cells with hidden viruses and microbes by puncturing them. They also rid the body of cancerous cells. There are also B cells that can turn into plasma cells. Plasma cells are special because they secrete millions of antibodies. Antibodies are large numbers of proteins that either grab, slow down, or clump together antigens, which are a kind of invader. Next are the complement proteins. Complement proteins inject liquid into microorganisms to make them burst and die after antibodies have got them. There are also suppressor T cells. After the immune system wins a battle, these cells send out chemical signals that tell the warriors not to come. Next, there are memory cells that remember invaders. If the same invader ever enters the body again, the immune system will be ready for it and kill it quickly. Now, once the battle is over, there are three ways of ridding the body of germs. Well, that's all for today, folks. Say goodbye, you little invader. Bye.